Hey there, are you tired of digging through endless folders to find the one you need? Well, today I've got a game-changing trick to share with you. In this video, you'll learn how to add comments to folders in Windows 11, making your file management a breeze. And as a bonus, I'll show you a sneaky way to add comments to every file. So stick around until the end to get the most out of this tutorial. To start, open up File Explorer and navigate to any folder on your computer. Click on the View drop-down button and select Details. Then, right-click somewhere on the top and select More from the context menu. In the appearing dialog, scroll down until you find Comments. Check the box next to it and click OK. Now you'll see a comment section next to your folders. Head to the View menu and select Show Hidden Items. This will reveal some secret files on your desktop, the mysterious Desktop Any files. Pick one of these desktop any files and copy it into the folder you want to customize. Then double click on the file to open it in your text editor. Now it's time to get creative. Delete the existing line of text and type info tip followed by your desired comment. This is where you can add a personal touch to your folder, making it more descriptive. Now that you've added your custom comment, it's time to save your changes Close Notepad and navigate back to the folder where you added the custom comment. Your folder should now display your custom comment. If the comment is not shown, you need to do a last thing. To display missing comments, you'll need to modify the folder's attribute. Specifically, the attribute must be set to system. To do this, open the command prompt and use the attrib command. Once you've made the change, comments should now be visible. You can also use the desktop any file to customize your desktop. It's a simple process. Download an icon file from the internet and place it inside the folder you want to customize. Use the property dialog window and set the hidden attribute. Now open up the desktop any file again. Enter the name of the icon file and make sure that you also specify the icon index. In my case, the icon consists of a single image, so I have set it to zero. This is how to customize a folder appearance and add a comment to a folder. But what if you want to add a comment to a file? Depending on the file type, you can simply open the Properties window and change the Comment on the Details tab. Please note that only certain file types such as MP3 files support this feature. Text files usually don't have a comment property. If you want to add a comment to a plain text file, you can use a third-party application or a file manager. Here I use Xiplorer, a paid file manager for Windows. After the comment column is activated, you can add comments to any file or folder. Later, you can sort by comments in your daily file management routine. At the beginning of this video, I told you that I would show you another more sophisticated method of adding a secret comment to a file. For this, I use alternative data streams. Let me show you briefly how this works. So here I have a simple text file. After double-clicking on the file, its content is visible in Notepad. To add a secret comment to the file, I open a command prompt. I use the echo command to add information to an alternate data stream that is not visible by default. If you run the dir slash r command, you will notice the secret passage. But in order to see what's in the section, you need to run a PowerShell command. The first command will display the content of the text file as displayed above in Notepad. After adding the section at the end, you can finally see the secret content of the alternate data stream. Adding comments to folders and files in Windows 11 is super simple, right? If this video helped you, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.